You've heard about the uh, nor'easter. There it is. New York getting quite a bit of snow, some heavy rain up through Boston for us. It's quiet, high pressure sneaking in behind it, and that's going to keep our skies clear. Blue sky around not only just for today, but through tomorrow as well. So we pause this through the overnight time frame. Clear skies as it drifts through the area through your Saturday. We still have a ton of blue sky out there as we go in through Sunday. And then we do increase the clouds a little bit through the day on Sunday. I think the rain showers hold off and Sunday looking dry for us, but those rain showers not too far behind and we'll see those move in through the day on Monday. So yeah, the UV index forecast, it's back. The sunshine gaining strength. Now, yeah, we don't have to worry about sunburn, but if you need something to do this afternoon, if you want to uh, start to maybe work on getting a little color back in the skin, about an hour if you sit outside, you'll do that with all the sunshine that we have around. So uh, again, a nice uh, stretch of sunshine ahead. 41 degrees today, well obviously we'll have to get that updated. <laughs> Mostly sunny and mild. I think a lot of us will top out into the middle 40s today this weekend. I think we'll be very similar as we go through Saturday. It'll really depend on when this lake breeze kicks in, but our inland areas will climb back into the mid to upper 40s. And then by Sunday, warmer yet, 44 degrees for our lakefront areas. And that's when our uh, inland locations have a chance to even hit 50 degrees. So a very nice weekend on top all the way through. Get outside, enjoy it, because as soon as the weekend comes to an end, yeah, the nice weather comes to an end. Rain showers and a lot of wind returns for Monday. We could mix in a few wet snowflakes on Monday, but I think for the most part that is rain. A rain snow mix on Tuesday, and then that will transition to all snow by Wednesday morning. And the bigger story then, the cold air that fills in. We're back in the 30s for Wednesday and Thursday at least.